Today's video is something different. Quite a while ago, I asked you guys via the YouTube community tab what you guys would like to see me do in the form of challenges. I said I would do these in a future video, but what I didn't mention was that it was going to be for my 100,000 subscriber special. I've collected a bunch of your suggestions, so what should I do? I don't know. Start the video, I guess. yourself on camera. JK, not really, I'm not that weird. Lol. Or poop your pants on camera, which one? Eat a raw hot dog on the toilet. Really, eat raw hot dog while singing raining tacos and it will confuse the neighbours, lol. I also subbed and turned on notifications. My mum has back pain. Try not to laugh challenge with water in your mouth. Spin around five times and shoot a ball to something. Take a fat dump before you start recording so jam. Does that mean face reveal? Do a setup tour, the stuff you use to make vids. My name is Jess and today I'm gonna show you my setup tour. This is my Blue Yeti microphone. It records really good audio. This is my drawing tablet. Up here, it's a Wacom and it's way cool. So we all know for editing, you need a good pair of headphones. I got these ones on sale, they've got Bluetooth. Thank you guys for watching my setup tour. I better get back to work. Doing something stereotypical Australian, which you otherwise never do. <laughs> Show us pictures of you pretending to be a dolphin, where you said, oops, I can't find them. Okay, so this is really embarrassing to look back at now. Um, but you guys asked for it, so here you go. Whoops. Fork in toaster. <laughs> Sorry, this is going to be really gross. Shape your poop into a heart. Okay, so I'm just going to roll it softly like this to get a slightly longer form. And try not to be too aggressive with it. Very gently, bend it into a pretty heart shape and you're finished. Ride a bike with no hands, standing up and juggle water balloons and sing the best you can. Sorry if it's a lot, here's something else if you don't want to do the first one. Ride a bike with no hands, standing up with an apple in your mouth. Um, of course I want to do this one. Whoa. Whoa. Record the outro with a shoe on your head. Oh, ho. in due time. Draw your character with your eyes closed. I honestly thought I was doing a good job with this, but little did I know how horrific this would turn out. Here's the head shape, the hair, the arms, and now both legs somehow down here. Some blushies. Yikes! Just be yourself. <laughs> Hi guys. Ride a skateboard while eating spaghetti. Or do ASMR. I'm going to be doing some whispering and tapping sounds for you guys today using the same jar of jam from earlier on. Tap, 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 tap. Fun fact. Fantastic squishing sound that can really trigger your ASMR. Just wonderful. Give me your biggest yeet! yeet! Paint yourself using a stick. This was the only stick I could find outside that wasn't still attached to a tree, so I'll just have to see how this goes. Dip, dip, dip. This was surprisingly difficult to control, as you can see by the crazy lines here. Dip, dip, dip. <laughs> this is it. 
<laughs> Giveaway time! If you have watched this far into the video, thank you. You will now have the chance to win a pen display graphics tablet from XP Pen. The people over at XP Pen were kind enough to send me one of their devices to review. First off, I just want to mention how nice the packaging is, as well as the little mascot they included for me. How cute! This tablet specifically is the Artist 12 Pro which features accurate pressure sensitivity, has support tilt function, which helps a lot in Photoshop, Painter, GIMP, etc. Here comes the most satisfying part. Oh yeah. It's got a nice fully laminated screen with nearly no parallax, something very important for pen display users. It also features this red wheel, which helps to quicken your workflow. Padding on the back here. Now for the accessories. XP Pen gives you a bunch of useful things here, including a stand for the tablet itself, which is always nice to have, and also various connectors depending where you live in the world. They give you a smudge glove, which was a pleasant surprise, as well as manual and information sheets. Here is the pen in its holder, and how the stand works for it. Before I forget, let's take a look at the mascot figurine, Phoenix. With this blank white figure, you can get creative and customize it yourself to suit your own taste. This is what I did. I was very surprised with the quality of this, as you can hear in the recording. This is a pretty solid figure. It's a very cool addition to the package. Let's power it on and give it a demo. Drawing on it is very smooth and accurate as they describe, and the pen is comfortable to use. Here's a quick little doodle for ya. <laughs> it is a really great tablet and I'm so happy I have the chance to give this away to one of you guys. All you need to do to enter in the giveaway is go over to my Twitter, give me a follow and retweet this post. And that's it. I'll pick the winner sometime in the next few weeks and we'll keep the winner updated via Twitter DMs about when the device can be shipped, since there might be slight delays due to the pandemic related shipping restrictions. Good luck everyone! Okay, so ending the video here with a tablet giveaway would be nice and all, but I made all this jelly in the intro and don't want it to go to waste. Thank you for watching. Thank you for 100k. Bye!